few days, I've noticed there's been someone lurking outside my house at night. I have no idea who it is, but when I came home today, I found a suspicious note at my door. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and read it. Um, uh, dear Carrie, I would love to see you soon. Want to meet up for lunch? Sincerely, Tristan. Oh my gosh, you guys, my creepy, horrible, awful ex-boyfriend Tristan left this note, which means he's probably been the one outside of my house the past few days stalking me, which honestly would not surprise me. And the note says he does want to meet me for lunch though. And normally I would not go near him, but I have got to put a stop to him bothering me. Okay guys, I'm on my way to the restaurant, right? Now, and since Tristan wanted to meet in a public place, we are going to the new burger place and I have no idea what he's planning. Here we go. All right, putting on my game face. I'm here to get answers. Carrie, you're here. I'm gonna say, yeah, that's what the note said. I have so much to tell you. Okay, well, what I wanna know is why you've been snooping around my house. And why do you want to meet here, okay? It, it's very strange for you to do something this public. He said, I'll tell you everything you want to know. Let's just get some food first. <sighs> okay, fine. I'm already here. I might as well eat something. I haven't gotten to try the burger place yet, so I guess this will knock out two birds with one stone. All right, all right. Looks like Tristan is getting the food. I'm going to go ahead and pick a table. All right, you guys. I have got my burger, and Tristan's acting kind of normal. But we are in a public place, so it doesn't look like he can set up any traps or anything. So I'm just gonna go ahead and ask, what do you need to tell me? Okay, maybe once he gets out what he has to say, he will answer my questions as to why he's been stalking me. Listen, Carrie. Oh, this isn't gonna be good. I know I've creeped you out in the past with my constant need for your love. Um, yeah, that's an understatement. But you know what? At least he's finally aware of it. I've decided you've had enough and don't deserve that anymore. Wait, what? It, it, guys, is he saying what I think he is saying right now? He said, I'm giving up on you and moving on. Uh, I'm gonna say, are, are, are you serious right now? I'm 100% serious. Guys, it doesn't seem like he's like pulling any tricks right now, but I don't know. This is a little weird. I'm so sorry for what I did. Guys, I think this might actually be a sincere apology. Um, which is very out of character. He said, I know I don't deserve this, but I would like to be friends because you're still very important to me. Okay, you guys, honestly, um, I don't really want to be friends with this guy, but he is apologizing and saying that he's going to leave me alone for good. So it might be better to just lie and say that we can be friends. Um, so you know what? I'm going to say, uh, okay, sure. We, we can be friends. Really? That's amazing. I promise I won't try to date you anymore. Wait, where are you going? Anyways, gotta run home now. Bye, Carrie. Wait, Tristan, I... Guys, he didn't even answer why he's been snooping around my house. Okay, guys, uh, I have got to get an answer to that before I can be quote-unquote friends with this guy. He is not getting off the hook that easy. All right, you guys, I am pulling up to Tristan's house right now because I need some answers as to why he's been snooping around my house. And guys, I am also not 100% sure that I believe that he's given up on me. So, let's see. Tristan's always got some sort of ulterior motive. So if he's surprised that I'm here, maybe he'll slip up and like start acting weird again. Guys, I mean, he has a bunch of windows and I'm not really seeing him. Hello, Tristan and what the? Guys, it's not looking like Tristan is home right now, but he left the restaurant earlier to come home. So it doesn't make sense that he wouldn't be here. Maybe this is part of whatever he's planning, whatever he's got going on. Uh, hello, Tristan! Tristan, open the door! What? What the? Uh, Mr. Who the heck is this? Mr. Quack, why does he look like that? He just said, hey, who are you? Uh, I'm assuming that this aggressive weirdo guy must be Tristan's neighbor or something. He said, if you're looking for that boy, he's long gone. Wait, um, huh? This, this is his house, is it not? It literally says Tristan's house right over there. He said he still owns that place as far as I know, but I haven't seen that weirdo boy at this house in a long time. So go away, you're noisy. Uh, hey! That was rude. Wait a second. Tristan hasn't been here in a long time. I mean, I guess that would explain the super old Christmas decorations. Okay, well, I guess if Tristan isn't living here right now, I don't have to waste any more time here. But if he's not here, then where the heck does he live? Okay, you guys, I am back home now and it has been such a long day. I definitely 
did not anticipate uh, having to meet up with my ex-boyfriend today or for him to be normal. Even though I still have some suspicions that uh, he's not actually as normal as he's making everyone think. Oh, oh, who the heck's at my door? Hello? Oh, UPS guy. Uh, delivery? Uh, I didn't order anything. What kind of present? What the heck is that? He said this delivery is for uh, Tristan? Huh? What, what the heck is a package for my ex-boyfriend being delivered to my house? I, wait, what the? Tristan? He just said, oh, that's for me. Thanks a lot, sir. Wait, what is going on? Here you go. Wait, hold on. That, so that package is actually for him? What? Tristan just said, thanks again. Corey said, you're welcome. See ya. He is literally accepting this package like he lives here or something. Um, why are you here and why are you ordering packages to my house? That doesn't make any sense. He said, ha, ha sorry about that, Carrie. I can totally explain. I don't know how the heck he's gonna explain this. Do you mind if I come inside for a bit? It's hot out here. Uh, guys, I don't really want to be alone with him in my house, but I have got to get to the bottom of this. This is too weird. I'm just gonna say fine, but only for a minute, okay? Only for long enough for you to explain what the heck's going on in here. He just said, great, thanks. All right, you better have a good reason. All right, now that we're inside, it is time to explain, okay? What's this package thing and why have you been stalking me at night, okay? Th that's literally crazy. And I know there's always been somebody outside my window, so don't even try to act like there wasn't. He said, okay, I'll answer everything. Oh, right, that's what he said last time, and then he left the burger place. First off, I'm traveling the world right now in my car and needed an address for my packages. Wait, huh? Th then why didn't you use your house? Okay, why the heck do you have to use my address? I should have, but your house was closer to where I was. Haha. -ha. Sorry for not asking. Okay, I mean, I guess that's weird, but like maybe understandable? I don't know. At least he gave me an answer though. But don't you worry. After all this, I'm going to travel the world and won't be back for a while. Oh, um, guys, if, if he's leaving to go travel, I, I guess that would make sense why he decided finally, like randomly to like try to not date me anymore. Uh, I'm just going to say, oh, uh, okay. As for the second question, that wasn't me. Wait, he was wasn't the one snooping around outside my house? What? Then who the heck was it? He, he said, anyway, so sorry again about all of this. But I gotta get back on the road now, though. It was nice to see you again, Carrie. Oh, uh, oh, okay, he said, I'll see you in a few months. And he's just leaving abruptly like that again? Guys, what the heck? Where um, seriously, you guys, what the heck? He just said that it wasn't him snooping around my house. Then who the heck was it? <sighs> okay, guys, I'm hanging out with Pat right now been so strange but it surprisingly ended on like a pretty good note because i don't have to deal with my creepy ex-boyfriend anymore Pat, hey why, why are you barking why are you barking we were having a good time and now you're being very hectic what hold on hold, okay 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 what are you looking at what what are you oh what the hey what the heck is that oh, that just came out of a hole in my backyard wait oh no where is he going wait guys that's the stalker and if Tristan said that he wasn't the one snooping around my house, then that means there is a new creepy guy in my backyard! Pat, Pat, yes, I know, I know, I am listening. Okay, guys, I have no idea what this stalker guy wants with me or is doing and why he just came from a secret hole underneath my house. But, guys, I don't know. I, Pat, 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 calm down. I just got rid of Tristan. I am not about to let another creepy guy come in and mess with all of my business, okay? I am putting a stop to this right now. All right, you guys, I am in my backyard and I saw the guy come out of a secret hole somewhere over here. There, there, there it is, you guys. I know for a fact I did not do this. I didn't do this. All right, here we go, you guys. Here goes nothing. I'm opening. Oh, whoa, what the? Oh, man. What the heck is this secret tunnel down here? Okay. Okay, guys, I'm moving. I'm gonna walk down here. Oh my gosh. How long has the stalker been here that he built this entire tunnel? Why is it so long? Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'm just gonna follow the tunnel. The stalker, I saw him leave, so he's not here. So that is good. All right. 
I'm just gonna get in here and see what the heck's going on and then call the cops or something. Oh, geez. Seriously, it's still going? What the heck is this? <gasps> oh, why is there a house underneath my house? What is going on down here? Okay, okay, guys, this is too weird. It's got like a patio and everything and the door's unlocked. The door is unlocked. Okay, you know what? It's time to do some snooping, you guys. Okay, you guys, this is too weird. I'm going to try to find maybe like a wallet or something so I can figure out who this person is. And then if I find their ID, I can go straight to the cops and have the cops arrest them without ever having to deal with any of this. Okay, you guys, let's see. Um, oh geez. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, literally it just looks like a very generic home, regular kitchen. Wait a second, guys, look at this package. That is the exact same package that Tristan picked up at my house earlier. Oh my gosh. That means this is Tristan's house. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. How, why, why did I believe him? Why did I believe him when he said it wasn't all right, all right, I'm going to keep on looking around. We've got a regular bathroom over here. Uh, it's a bedroom. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. And ah, ah, what the? Oh my gosh, he has an entire room dedicated to just pictures of me and a weird statue. What is going on in here? How long has he been under here? Wait, wait. guys, his house still had Christmas decorations up. He has been down here for months. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. I, I've got to go to the cops right now. I Okay, okay, you know what? This is fine, this is fine. I can just leave here and he'll never know that I am. Ah, Tristan. Uh-oh, uh-oh, you guys. He said, what the? Carrie, how did you get down here? How did I get down here? How did you get down here? How did you even build this? What are you doing with this house? He's literally just staring at me. I'm gonna say, I demand to know what is going on here, all right? I am not playing nice anymore. I let my guard down, you guys. I shouldn't have let my guard down. Fine, if you wanna know, I'll tell you. Uh, if I wanna know, you built an entire house under my house. Of course I wanna know. Oh, this is too much. This is too much. I jinxed it. I jinxed it when I said the day ended on a good note. He said, I only agreed to give up on dating you. But I need to be near you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Creepy face. Creepy face, Tristan. What? He said, otherwise, I'll never be happy. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. And guys, I knew there had to be some ulterior motive. Okay. Okay. You know what? Be brave, Carrie. Be brave. I'm going to say, I'm putting a stop to this, okay? You need to leave now. Guys, I cannot believe I actually thought he was normal. I'm gonna say you tricked me for the last time, okay? You need to leave me alone, all right? I am not dealing with this anymore, he said. I'm glad you're here, though. Nope, we're not, we're not doing this. We are not doing this again, okay? I am going to have you put in jail forever and ever and ever. He said, what? No, please let me stay here. What? I promise I won't even bother you. You're already bothering me. Okay, you can't just have a house under my house. You have to leave. I refuse to let you stay. I never want to see you again. Please, I'll just be living here. It's no big deal. It is a big deal. Fine, if you won't let me stay, then, then leave. I'm not letting you stay, so you have to leave. I'm just gonna have to keep you trapped down here with me. What? What? No, 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 guys. Guys, this is bad. This is bad. There's only one exit to this house, and he is looking crazy again. Uh, uh, no, uh, you, you leave me alone. Leave me alone. He said it's the only way. Leave me alone. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, you guys. This is bad. This is bad. I'm starting to freak out. He said we can be together forever. Oh, no. Pat. Pat. Oh, my gosh, yes. Pat's here. Holy cow. I am so glad that Pat is protective. He just said, ah. Okay, get him. Get him, Pat. He said, get him. Fight him. Go, go. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. He's going for him. Pat is being so aggressive. 
side. And I might even need to move. 